Hello, hello, hello. How is everybody doing? So Shani and Rev obviously got Chinese food. They are live, so we're going to jump right into it. Hope y'all are having a great day. Pepsi. Oh. Pepsi. Pepsi. Why are you using Christmas cups, weirdo? Pepsi. Pepsi. What is going on with her cheeks, her dude? Her Pepsi. cheeks, she's got like a rash yes. on her oh, face. God, this is amazing. We will get our food. We get our food. Our food will be so good. Damn, dude. Look at the fucking size of those arms. Holy cow. Every time, like, it never ceases to amaze me when I watch the stuff, like, and with, like, her, I mean, like, I, I, I'm not trying to fat shame. I'm really not. But, like, it's on another level with her. The fact that she can sit there and act like she's losing weight, she's got to be in denial. Like, just total denial. We're gonna be happy. Or delusional. Because it makes us feel good. We got our food. Are y'all reading some of we these uh, got our food. comments here? Because <laughs> they are. Oh, that's, that's your soup. They oh, are crazy. Got the, you got the soup. Oh, okay. Egg roll. I got the egg roll. Okay. Yes. Fortune cookie. Fortune cookie. Give you ten tools. Okay, you, you probably want that. That's what's crazy, tools. guys, is that she's claiming she's lost all this weight, but unless my eyes are playing tricks on me, to me, she looks like she's gained weight. She hasn't lost. She's gained. Sesame tree. Sesame chicken? You did, Brooke? <laughs> yeah, they're live. I'm not a cat. Beef and broccoli. Oh, my God. Oops. And the fortune cookies? Yeah, here. We got two. One for you, one for me. Oh, my God. Foods. Foods. This I'm is going to be gross to watch, you guys. I'm excited for foods, too. Oh, foods. Foods. Look at Thank these you. idiots. Thank you. For foods. For foods. It's an answered prayer. Oh. I told you it was going to happen. Jesus did. Yeah, you only had to beg for it for three days oh. straight. Oh. Dude, it Sesame would have been hilarious chicken. if he dropped that shit. But actually, I should be having the soup first. Look at this. Some delicious. Get ready to get grossed out, everybody. And broccoli. Look at that. Oh. I have an egg roll. He has some wonton soup. Wonton soup. Oh my god. This was my favorite Chinese place as a kid growing up. Is there up. any sauces? There is. Yeah, there are. Ew. Mm. Ew, I can't watch this. Fuck. Oh. Get some duck sauce. Wait. Oh. God, the broth is so good. Put the duck sauce in there. How is she going to eat an egg roll like that without, oh, yeah. like, breaking oh, yeah. her teeth that she has oh. left? Ew! Ew! Mm. Oh, my God. Mm. That was worse than, oh, my God. Mm-mm. Mm-mm. Mm. Such good wonton soup. Mm. I can't with the noises. I can't mm. with the noises, guys. Mm. Oh, God. That's awful. Mm. Oh. She's literally deep throating mm. a fucking egg roll. Their broth mm. has gotten so much more flavorful. Mm. Oh, no. She literally sounds like a cow at this point. Mm. Meow. This is so good. Yeah. Oh, Moonface Pondu, you you said I'm convinced now she's being fueled uh, or funded by feeders. You're probably right. You're probably that's the only people I can imagine would pay 
to watch this. You know what I'm saying? Everybody else is just disgusted. Oh, uh, yeah. Thank you, Moonface, for the um, super mm. chat. It is so good. Oh, fresh yummy. Chew with your mouth closed, Jenny. My mm. God. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh yeah. Sesame chicken. Oh, you get that, baby. You get it, go get it. Get it. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, yeah. Oh, that nice sauce all over it. It's it so good, yeah. Oh, yeah. The fuck is wrong mm. with her? No. Can't you tell what a nice, <laughs> sweet Christian woman this is, guys? Can't you tell? She's just a, a kind, lonely little Christian woman. Trying to be out in the world doing good. <laughs> thank you so much. Yeah, right. Mm, Fucking thank gross. You. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And to think, from her own mouth, she has said that her kids watch her content. She said that. Not me. She said that. That she knows that her kids watch her content. And this is what she does. Donka. Donka. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Some beef and broccoli. Oh my god. Mm. Mm. Oh. Mm. Oh. Ooh, oh, baby, it's so good. Oh yeah. Like Shanny, oh, yeah. just stop it already. Oh my god. Look at that. Oh yeah. It's gonna be tender. Mm. Mm. Oh my god. Mm. Is it not chewy? Try that, baby. No, why is that here? You sure? Would it surprise mm -hmm. me, Michael? It would not mm -hmm. surprise mm -hmm. me. Unless you want to try mine. Then I'll try yeah. It. Okay. Oh no, you're gonna pay for that later, Rev. Yeah. How dare you take yeah. any of her food and not give her all of yours? Sauce. Can't you mm. see she's starving? Bomb. And you have the nerve to sit there and eat? Mm-hmm. That's like healthy. How dare you, Rev? Yeah. How it's like dare you? Sauce and just like juice. Yeah. It's healthy. Oh my God, it's so good. I'm health conscious. No. Mm -hmm. Bitch, shut the mm -hmm. fuck up. Health oh conscious, my, God, my ass. This is so good. Mm. Please let this end Poor soon. Life, right? I can't handle these mm, noises it's like much longer. On a date. This is cool. Yeah, true. Chinese date, honey. I love you. Mm. Crackhead date, honey. Chinese date. I love you. Mm. Mm. Oh my god, this is so good. It's so good. Oh my god. Mm. Mm. Fucking rice is a challenge, though. Mm. Mm. Like, white rice is pretty easy to eat with chopsticks. I mean, am I weird oh, that, that I don't make these noises when I eat? Is this how you guys, when you eat, do you make noises like this? Because I can't not imagine doing this. Like, sitting at the table with your family and being like, Mmm. Oh. Mmm. 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 Oh, yeah. Mmm. Mmm. Ooh. Mmm. Yeah. Like, the fuck? Who the fuck does this shit? Oh, Shady and Rev. I love That's who you. does it. This is live, right? Yes, it is. Yeah. Hi, monkey toes. Oh. Sorry about the jerkwads in my chat. They're just being dicks. Being dicks to be dicks. They, they need attention. But I block their asses. Oh, God. I'm that type of boss bitch. Mm. Oh, my God. I'm going to quit something. You want some soy sauce for your rice? Uh, I usually eat my fried rice plain. Okay. I might try it, though, because you're trying it. Thank you. I'm going to. I love soy sauce on my oh rice. Oh, my God. This is such there's a just blessing. A, there's just an extra 
I know. Pulse of Defiance. I know. Hi, Treva. Oh, yeah. You saved my life because I really need Do yeah, you? Do you make noises you. like both. that? Yeah. When you're eating haagen -Dazs? Are you by yourself when you do it? Then maybe I could see it, too. We both needed food. Oh. Oh, Cocktopus Prime. She's got to get as much sodium as possible into her, uh, her heart arteries. Doesn't matter if there was already soy sauce there. She needs more. A lot this is more. So good. I mean, if we told them about the crazy bullshit going on with the EBT card. Oh, I'm not even going into that. Oh. No, oh. Oh. So there is crazy shit going on with the EBT card. So we were right, guys. The whole thing that they've been talking about doing applications for and shit, it's not for jobs. It's for food stamps. Because they haven't gotten their food stamps. Because they probably had to renew um, the application. So, if there was any doubt in your mind that that was for a job, yeah. Exactly. No job. Mm -mm. They can't even... It took so them all day. Mean, they I literally said the other day, it took them all day. We were adulting all day doing, um, a, you know, applications and we're so tired. Bitch, all y'all were doing was talking to the EBT people on the phone for a while. That's it. These fucking two. Mm. All right, I'm going to try to shut up for a minute so you guys can watch this nasty shit. Mm. Hi, Drader. How are you doing? Mm. Shanny with Chinese Be prepared to get Popeye grossed out, finished? Drader. This is disgusting. Probably. I thought that would be pizza for you. No. Pizza's just my snack. Oh, okay. <laughs> Pizza's just her snack. <laughs> At least she told us truth about mm. that, I guess. <laughs> Pizza's just a snack. Oh, great food. Oh, God. I'm done with drama. Oh. Yeah, sure you are. Till five minutes down the road. I don't pay anything anyone does. Bullshit. I just ignore it because it's like. Yeah, you ignore everything, It's usually like freaking <laughs> stupid. Yeah, I agree. If by ignore you mean throw a fit Don't and block then people, answer to then stupidity. yeah. Well, it's like 90% lies, so. Well, yeah. Like yeah, her said. body proportions do not make like, sense at all. I'm a grown-ass adult. I'm a grown-ass adult. Bitch, you're a grown-ass adult who had to beg for Chinese food for three days to get it. Because you guys can't do shit for yourself. But you want to get on here and, oh, I'm a grown-ass adult. No, the fuck you aren't. You might as well be a child. Oh. I do have time to eat Chinese food, though. For a mukbang. And focus on that shit. You're making money just for mukbang. Hell yeah, man. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm. Hell yeah, man. No, you're not Thank making you money from doing this. You literally pimped yourself out for Chinese food. You pimped yourself out for Chinese food, Shani. That's how fucking pathetic you are. My sponsor. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, stuff in her face is Everyone's such a hard job. Everyone's having a with EBT across the states. Okay, really. Really? Really? Well, really? So He's shocked because he knows that the reason they're having issues with the EBT is because of their own bullshit. That's why. So, oh, other people are having problems with their EBT across the uh, the country. Oh, really? Oh, good. Thanks for telling me that. Now we can run with that excuse. But not that that's a good thing. I'm. It's not. It's horrible. But it's oh, not at least we're not the only one. Mm -hmm. Not unique to us. Yeah. They're so full of shit. Right, Octopus Prime? Oh, I'm telling you, my my son, way more responsible than either one of these two. In some ways, my son is honestly more responsible than me. He's really, really good with money and things, but these two, I mean, they might as well be 12-year-olds.
I saw that 21 V2. I definitely can't taste like I used to. Though. You I can't taste like you used to? It's because you're not fucking even chewing. You're inhaling the food. Whatever they're trying to make it into, I don't understand. All I said was like, I was just hurt by it. And I'm hurt by it now. And Wah. then I love them, so I don't worry about that anymore. Shani, let me clue you in. Anyone who's being nice to you in your chat, they're all trolls. When the fuck are you going to wake the hell up and realize this? How many times do you have to find out that someone that was being nice to you is a troll for you to get that that's all that's in your fucking chat? That's it. No one is ever seriously being nice to you. Remember that. Simple as that. In this biz, people will straight up. I should be here and not give a crap about what your feelings are. Like you give a shit about anyone else's feelings anyway. So, whatever. Yeah, pretty much. Whatever. Whatever. I said what I needed to say, you know? Yeah. I'm a real bitch. I no, no, I'm telling you, they're, it, they're no. not doing it to be nice, though. It's people that are manipulating the situation because people that are giving them food, they just want to get them on camera so that they can make fun of them. That's it. I'm telling you. These people do not, they don't have anyone in their life that really cares for them. Because they're both fucking selfish pieces of shit. If I feel it, I'm gonna say something. You know? Yeah. And they don't care about anyone either. The only reason they're being nice and doing what they're doing right now is because they got food out of it. They're just as guilty. Mm. Yeah. They get used and they use well, people back. Whatever. It is what it is. It is what it is. I'm enjoying Chinese food right now. Oh, and we can tell. Keep shoveling that shit mm -hmm. in your fucking gullet. For not caring, you sure are reading all the comments. Look at that face. <laughs> I'm just going to focus on the food because it's so good. That's what I'm doing. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, I see mm. someone's already talking shit about me in there. Ooh, like, these people down. are pathetic. They're so fucking pathetic. I'm, I and am desperate too. for attention. Like, mm. oh my god. Like, I barely went through it, but... That's true. That's usually how my stomach goes. Mm -hmm. mm. Oh. Look, y'all. Shani no can barely eat. Can't you tell? Oh. She can barely what? eat. All right. Mm. Mm. The weight just falls off of her because she I'm barely eats anything. I'm gonna get this more often because this is a little bit more. Um, she just shovels it in her fucking mouth. There's no bread in or anything on it. Mm. Ew. It's gluten free. Ew! She and it's a little bit. Did y'all see that? I get a good. She literally about food. wiped her booger snot mm -hmm. on Rev. Look mm -hmm. at this. Our, um, it's gluten free. Look! She, did you see? Hold on. Let me go back. Watch. Because she never no uses a damn that. tissue. Oh. One more. All right. Mm -hmm. Watch this. I'm going to get this more often because this is a little bit more, um, there's no bread in or anything on it. Watch. She's about to wipe her nose. It's gluten free. And then, oh, can I wipe it over here? <laughs> it's a little bit more healthier plus I get a good uh, you know, red meat protein, you know? I would have loved it if she would have wiped it right on him. Stick with that. That would have cracked me up. 
maybe eventually switch it up to like, oh, excuse me, white rice. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can switch out white rice. No problem. That's right. It's deep black one. Correct. Now what? I know, right? Mm. Mm. That food was good. Um, awfully pretty storm. No one was talking about Carrie. Apparently, it was a joke. I'm talking about this comment right here in their chat. It's my name's right there. Um, it's weird what kind of weirdo runs off to Carrie and whines about someone who just wants to t some Chinese food and then takes time, takes the time to animate a response. That's what I was talking about. That comment. Oh, well, that's for our sponsor. You know. Oh. Jesus, he licked it fucking clean. Yep. This dude does not. Daddy, eat. take care of it in one sitting, mommy. Oh, let's let's have our cookies. Oh yeah, absolutely. And then we'll have our cigarette device. Yeah. Ew. Oh my God. There we go. My throat. Jesus, they are fucking disgusting, dude. In <laughs> Italian, that means it was really good. In French. Yeah. That literally, there was rice that came up my throat. I thought I was going to uh, uh, choke. <laughs> <laughs> and I just, I still almost vomit. Ew. Yeah, bro. <laughs> that was so good. Yeah. Oh, my God. That's for the sponsor, though. Some people love that when you finish your plate. Yeah. They love that for the mukbang. Oh, that was so amazing. No, V. Okay, did you get a good? What happened? I'm looking. I'm, I'm going to break mine open you first. You didn't offend me. What, you, what, what happened? Okay. Did I miss something? Okay. Mine says. Oh, I got that you. bread today. I got okay. you. Um, JP, thank you so much for the super chat. You said they got money for this. People stop giving them money. You're preaching to the choir, dude. <laughs> You are preaching to the choir. Oh, that's you in there talking shit, 21 VTubes. Come over here. I'm going to kick your ass. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Nice. To, okay, I got it. I got what's going on now. Thanks right, for cluing me in. Money. Sorry money. about that. Um, that's all right. Awfully pretty storm. Yeah, if you want to give right. us money, I'm, I, I'm always welcome to that. The fortune cookie said. Yeah. What does your say? Mm -hmm. I know, it says FTS. Oh, okay. There's so much more to come. All right. So we're going to get that bread and more to come. All right, man. Keep the bowls for ramen. Heck yeah. Can't see shit on me. No, you can't. Rev, you look like you're dying, bro. Like, your blue lips look blue. Yeah, and underneath family. his eyes look so purple and shit. Like, mm -hmm. Rev, you need to go to the doctor too. You don't look well. Mm -mm. It's not. Mm -mm. No, that was really good, man. Mm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. That's a good vanilla taste to it. Pretty good. They're not stale this time. No. Ah. A cigarette of, of, of appreciations. Would I be able to have just a little bit more Pepsi? Yeah, I wouldn't mind some more yeah, Pepsi, too. Okay. A then cigarette celebration. And wow! Then. What a wow! Where the hell? Where'd the Pepsi go? I don't know. Oh, my God. I put it over here. Oh. oh. Wow. Sorry. <laughs> I am sorry. <laughs> see, they say, they say Romeo, Romeo was fucking goofy, so I'm goofy like that. My Romeo? Baby. Wait a minute. So goofy like Romeo. I know he ain't talking about Romeo and Juliet like that Romeo. I know he ain't talking about that. That is the last thing that you're like, Rev. Are you fucking crazy? Oh, what? Sorry. Because he filled up her Cheers. fucking Cheers. Pepsi cup. Oh my god, I can't. 
to good tidings. Yeah, that's like Viking shit. That's Viking To good shit? tidings and to a wonderful meal. And thank you, Jesus, for answering oh. my prayers. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. See, you thank have you, Jesus. Actual, you have an actual... Thank you, Jesus, for answering my prayers for Chinese food. Um, And, you know, maybe one day... uh. When I don't need Chinese food so bad, I'll start praying for my kids to get my kids back. But until then, I got to get my Chinese food, Jesus. That comes first. Actual, it was all documented case, Shani, of answered prayer. Yep. It was all documented. Yep. Wait until that million dollar prayer comes in. Yeah. That million dollar prayer. I believe the Lord. I believe him too. When are you going to start praying for your boys, you dumb bitch? I believe him that I could sell my book to a studio. Or Literally cries over that some cookies. Awesome. I believe Has never that. shed a tear yeah. about her boys being gone. I think they're ready for that type of story. Well, Knowing how Picard is going. I really like that show. <laughs> I very much appreciate that too. Picard's awesome. Yep. You know oh. what we should do? Oh. We should react to this mook vein. Oh my god. Why? Well, they're, uh, they're on, a, on, on YouTube. Yeah, we should do that. Let's do it. Right. We'll do it. That's so stupid. They're going to watch themselves You eat. go to the Losers Club on YouTube? They usually steal our content and, you know, really... Put, like, Mr. Yuck's... Oh, man. They, they're so mean toward us. Pretty weird. Mm-hmm. Because your piece is a shit. Those two weirdos with the Mr. Yuck freaking... Like, what? what is wrong with the Losers Club? It's bizarre, man. I know. And they try to sound like us, too. Mm -hmm. Oh, so my weird. God. Shut probably the fuck up. Me all the time. Maybe. This probably does that shit. Maybe. We're so witty, guys. Weird. We're so witty. Because we're, like, under contract. We can't be looking not cool, man. That's true. Uh, what yeah. kind of math? Fuck, movie? she's nasty. Yeah, sort of. Kind Who of does in that? A in a ner nerd chic. Nerd, nerd. I'm not saying that you have to be a girly girl and shit in life, but to sit there and fucking burp like she does, it's just so gross, dude. Be a fucking lady for once in your life, Shani. Could you ever handle that? Nerd chic? No. Nerd chic. Nerd bum. Nerd bum? Nerd, okay. Nerd bum. Dude. Nerd bum. Mm -hmm. I think that'll work. For, right, Repeat I mean, that, look, the burp? I, I, those two weirdos with the Mr. Yuck freaking... Like, what? what is wrong with the Losers Club? It's bizarre, man. I know. And they try to sound like us, too. Mm -hmm. So weird. Probably that one guy that impersonates me all the time. Maybe. He probably does that shit. Maybe. Oh. That could be it. Lol's cow, were they just talking about you? I think they were just talking about you, bro. 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 <laughs> Thank you, Jesus. Because we're like under contract. We can't be looking not cool, man. That's true. Uh, what yeah. kind of matching almost? Disgusting. Yeah, sort of. kind Disgusting. Of in, in a ner nerd chic. Ner nerd chic? That's nerd more. chic. Nerd bum. Nerd bum? Nerd, okay. Nerd bum, dude. Nerd bum. Mm -hmm. I think that'll work. For Christ, I mean, look, I got I got a friggin' Batman, like, hoodie cap thing. True. Beanie hoodie cap, cap That's, like, thing. Almost, uh, a beanie? Geek. Oh, that is geekdom type stuff. Yeah, I think so. They're trying to be funny. They're not under so contract. Mean. They're idiots. They think they're, they're oh, that was being really meal. funny and witty. I'm glad I can finally get, a, like, an actual beard, scruffy beard look now. It's mm -hmm. too much like a boy. You know, I got to just go. I can do that now. That's man. cool, dude. Yeah. I love you. I think you helped me with that. Really? Uh, uh hair Thanks. growth. Thanks. Ew. That's true. Thanks. The best beard oil. Oh, really? Oh. Yeah. The yes. best in the whole entire world. You can't mimic it. <clears throat> no. If you know, you know. 
you know. We don't. Nobody in our chat is speaking. They're just watching us. All right. Lurking. That's cool. 71 watching. Holy crap. Yeah. Thank you for all the viewers. Yeah, thanks for the views, guys. You kick ass. I very much appreciate it, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah, guys. guys. <laughs> this, uh, hey, why not come here and do mukbangs? Like, that's cool. Yeah. Like, would you guys like that if we did this, like, on a fairly... I'm like, sure you would like it. Through, maybe more. I don't know. I don't know. How it, uh, if you want to sponsor us. I right. Think. However many times yeah, people are willing to feed your ass. Nothing gross. Not spicy. You could, like, do damage to us at this point. No. Rev, get a fucking job, my dude. It's not everyone else's fucking responsibility to feed you and your fat-ass wife. So, get a job, dude. Then you can eat out every day if you want to. Y'all are pathetic. I think so fucking pathetic. Gastrointestinal issues. Too old for that stuff now. Mm-hmm. We're hitting our Oh, guys. I missed a super chat. Yes. Hold on, let me see. We can't do the things that oh, we Oh, Nina, thank you so much. This is to help pay the rent for living in Shanny Sims heads. Thank you, Nina. I'm so sorry I didn't see that at first. Thank you so much for the super chat and for being awesome. Nina, you're awesome. I love you. To do and that 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 includes like drama related material. We can't do that anymore. Yeah, it messes up. It does, man. It's that is so true, Octopus Prime. Mm -hmm. And and your health should mean something. True. It really should, guys. Um, let me see if I can zoom in. I don't know if I can. Oh, that's not going to work. Let's see. I can zoom in that much. Is that what you meant? Something like this? They don't look as dark when you're zoomed in a little bit more. So think about your health. It's important. It is. Very much so. While we smoke cigarettes. <laughs> yeah, well. Mm. Smoke in the temple. This is for smoke in the temple. Because his priests need it. Yeah, that's true. It's how we get to what he wants separating the flesh from the spirit holy earth holy plants through many cultures holy plants like man. tobacco yeah right tobacco is a sacred plant that god created our creator on earth he didn't create cigarettes, you dumbass. So, like, when I die, guys, oh my in order God. to honor me, just break a cigarette and just put it on the the land. Don't don't put the, the this part. Just the tobacco. Not the not the filter, but I mean the tobacco. That's how why would I respect. waste? Why would I waste the tobac tobacco to put it on you? That would definitely be my deal. I'll take. No it. way. Hell yeah, man. I'd rather give it to a bum to smoke. Here you go, man. Here's a reverend cigarette. Thank you, dude. You'll, you'll hear it in the wind when I'm dead. Yep. Thank you. Uh, dude, Rev looks high. That's what he looks like. Look how his eyes are. That's a nice thought, though. Isn't it? Yeah, just leave the tobacco at my gravesite. Right. And then you come back and it's smoke. Whoa! What? No That's impossible. No, it's not. No, it's not. No. With God, all things are possible. Everything is possible. With God, all things are possible. I told you, my. So, uh, with God, you, uh, you can smoke cigarettes. You just gotta have God's help in the afterlife, and 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 anything's possible. My prayers will be answered, and what did everyone do? But it, but it is true. What is true? That you're a fucking piece of shit. Can I just comment? And I'll show you about the million dollars too, and God, He'll do that too for me. Here we go. I guarantee it. Yeah. 
Okay, we'll see what about that. What are you going to do? Are you going to stop believing in God? Are you going to start believing in God if I get a million dollars? No. Yay. Is that what it takes? Maybe. My proof right. in God has nothing to do Possibly with you at all. Right? Mm -hmm. I'm going to prove that prayer works. Okay, Shani. Well, then start praying for your day. kids. You're going to prove that prayer works. So you've uh, prayed for Chinese food. You're going to pray for millions of dollars. When are you going to start praying to get your kids back? Is that ever going to fucking happen? Or is that not, that's not a prayer that you would like answered? I'm proving prayer works every day. Yeah. My God matters. My God matters. He Do your was kids risen matter? on the third, third day. day. That's awesome. Okay, that should be made into something for kids. Yeah, man. He was risen on the third day. Jesus is an affirmation song for kids. Oh, that my God. Snoop would awesome. do that. Dude. Snoop. Snoop. Get, get on it. Dude. A Jesus affirmation song. Hey, Rev. Lay off the fucking drugs, bro. What are you on today? Like, look at this guy. You're telling me this guy ain't high on drugs? There's not a fucking chance in hell that he's sober. Not a chance in hell. Right? We gotta proclaim the gospel every day. <laughs> I yeah, can see it, right? Dude. I can see him doing that. We, that would be awesome. Mm -hmm. That would be awesome. A gospel kids thing. That would be great. Snoop would do it in a second. It's like, what? Get a green like that. <laughs> I like that. I like that. He loves Jesus. He does. I didn't agree with him on putting the toe, toe tag on Trump. I didn't agree with that. But he has his freedom of speech, though. It was pretty extreme use of free speech, but he, he, he did it. So. It is what it is. Yeah, he did it. All right. Wow. Peace. And Maranatha. That thing. Have a wonderful, wonderful day, guys. I'll see you when I see ya. Toodaloo. Wow, dude. That was pretty pathetic. That was pretty pathetic, guys. Um, so, I wonder if they're gonna... They probably will end up coming back on. Um, but would you guys... Is there something that you guys want to watch while we're here? Um, I can pull up some stuff. Since we're here, we might as well do something, right? Let's see. Mm. Okay. We're going to go like this. Let's see what Lulz Cow Product... Lil's Cow hadn't done anything new in a couple of days, but let's watch this cookies one. I've only watched this once, I think, on here, so we'll give it another shot. Katie, Shani's video from yesterday. What video from yesterday? Drop a link in the chat for it, Katie, and I'll pull it up after this. You can smell it, please. What died on her face? Rip can eat the food scraps when I'm done. Oh, Octopus Prime. Yes, that's what I'm gonna go to next. I got you. But he must save the bears. Only eat grain and nuts. I'll gas him up and eat all food alone. Rev will catch my hands and bring him lots of harm. Unless he eats my scraps off the floor. I'll punch him in the lip for not following the script. Take his peanut body left no more. If you don't want to punch, you'll hand over your lunch. It is better for you this way. And if you take my cookies, my grass, I would cookies. I might blow up and get more views. You can tell my ass is as big as Kansas. Rip can only eat what he sits in bed. 
I eat my cookie and dip. The weight never hits my head. Rev never liked cookies anyway. I don't start my squeeze. Eat anything he please. Rev is kind of thin but looks okay. You know Mama Shen is looking kind of fine. If you don't think you must be on your mind. If you don't want to punch, you'll handle your lunch. It is better for you this way. If I guess like this man, this pathetic little man, he will blow up and give me lots of views. Don't want to punch your hand of your lunch. It is better for you this way. And if you take my cookies, my grass powder cookies, I might blow up and get more views. If you don't want to punch your hand of your lunch, it is better for you this way. If I got like this man, this pathetic little man, he will blow up and get me views. If anybody dropped the link in the chat to Lowell's Cow Productions channel, so let me grab that really quick. And then I'm going to play a couple of requests that we got here. Here we go. Let me grab that for you guys and drop it in the chat. Definitely go and subscribe. They've got some great stuff. We'll listen to some more of their stuff um, later in the stream. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and pull up this one. This is from yesterday. Let's see what Shani had to say. If you guys haven't seen this yet, it's a short one. Don't get it twisted. When I said, what's wrong with you on my last live stream, it was because people came in talking about little mama and saying that they were looking up her death certificate and she didn't have one. And they were looking up uh, at funeral homes to see if she was there. That is most disgusting stuff I've ever heard. And I don't even want to talk to anyone after that. It's that disturbing. That's why I said, what's wrong with you? And here the drama channels are trying to twist it and say there was something wrong with me and Jason. <laughs> like I was saying something against Jason. No, I was saying something wrong with the drama channels, literally putting it out there in an accusation that someone didn't die of suicide so they could avoid culpability of being, you know, the reason why she did what she did. Mm hmm Like, ugh. That's what I'm done. Uh, yeah. But you can say what you yeah, want to just, say. Yeah, just I want to say it quick because I, I don't want to step on your toes. It's your channel. But I for, for the record, that had nothing to do with me and Shani, okay? What it had to do with is these people. This the, the, you These people that did this pursued having her do this. They wanted her to do it. And then after it happened... They don't take credit for it. They say, oh, it didn't even happen. I mean, it's so abusive and sick, and I hope that the husband really can get something. That's me, all I'm going to say. Me get too. Something. No, he deserves something. But it's disgusting what these people did. But get I something. just, like, I'd rather do something positive in my life than oh, please. deal with people like that right now. I mm -hmm. mean, they really need to repent to Jesus. Yeah. Ugh. Gross. Jesus Christ, rebuke you. Mm -hmm. Wow, Shani. Mm -hmm. All right. Let's see. We got another request from Nina. This one's from Nina. This one is not to do with Shani. It's just sweet. So we're going to watch it real quick. And then we're going to watch Shani 
and how she acted and talked about Rev while he was in jail. Oh, so sweet. So sweet. I love it. I do love it. I hope that if I ever had to be in the hospital like that, <clears throat> although it's his service animal, so that's why he gets to have it. But God, that would make it a lot less. Um, scary you know what i mean all right let's pull this up for tj i've watched a little bit of this before on a stream so i'm going to start where we left off because it wasn't far into it because this is a three hour long stream so there's no way we're going to watch and be able to see all of it but there's some pretty shocking stuff that she says in this so it's worth a watch if you haven't seen this before it's definitely worth or even if you have it's worth watching again and just seeing just how fucked up she was and in, in, in the things that she was saying about Rev while he was in jail. Not that he didn't deserve it, but. And you just do it anyway. And this is from XX Archives. Let me how many times did, does, did the man have to be told to stop yelling to the top of his lungs all the time? Just constant yelling, screaming, just. I couldn't even get peace. I couldn't even get peace with him. Like, no peace of mind. Just constant, over and over and over and over and over and over and over again. Like... Oh. Yeah, you can't make someone to give a damn, can you? You can't will someone to change. You are very correct on that. Uh-oh, it's not synced up exactly right, it looks like. So just so that doesn't throw you off, I think it does catch up later. He doesn't care that you and the boys need him to be responsible. You can't depend on him, and his attitude just brought you down. Yeah. Yeah, and, and now he wants me to pay for his Bye, fucking Sky phone woman. calls. Like. Hi, please notice listen, me. Listen, you spoiled little fucking brat. I am not oh. going to pay for your fucking phone calls when you're the reason your ass got put in jail. Ooh, little fucking hold on. Listen to this. Let's listen to this again. Pay for his fucking phone calls. Like. Oh, you did, Skywoman? I didn't see it yet. I will check that out, though. Thanks for letting me know. Listen, you spoiled little fucking brat. I am not gonna pay for your fucking phone calls when you're the reason your ass got put in jail. Because you couldn't listen to me and keep your hands to yourself. You couldn't, you couldn't, you couldn't listen to me and, and be like, stop treating Zachary bad. You couldn't do that. Instead, you treat him worse. Over a movie and some fucking cards. And I can't trust that you're not going to do something like that again. I can't. Because you've already done it. Hi, Kitten Hotel. Yeah, exactly. Hi, I have to job. feed my kids. I Hi, can't afford, afford phone calls. Like, like, does he fucking, like, realize what the fuck he actually did? Does he realize that? 
Hi, Ronnie Bunny. Does he, does he, like, does it come in his mind that I kept telling? Um, yeah, Billy Kay, they did, they, they're on Rumble still, um, they just did a mukbang on there with chi of Chinese food. They go on there when they want to show their face, because they don't show their faces on their YouTube channel. So, they still have it, they just don't stream there very much. On him that I'm tired of it? I don't deserve to be treated badly. I don't. I do my best not to hurt or, or offend anyone. Bullshit. Bullshit. I generally don't think he understands the gravity of the situation. Does he think he could just manipulate me back in a relationship? Like, here, baby, I almost crushed your child's chest and head in what wow listen to that again Love shit. listen to that I generally don't think he understands the gravity of the situation does he think he could just manipulate me back in a relationship like here baby i almost crushed your child's chest and head in crushed love me your child's head in and she took him back Go love yourself. Aw, thank you, Bruce. You said, Shanny, I'm not going to pay for Rev's phone call calls. Rev's bank account, hold my beer. <laughs> thank you for the super chat, Bruce. Yeah, she's ridiculous. Go love yourself. It's disgusting what the fuck you did to my son. It's disgusting. Like, and he doesn't even, like, he always says there's something wrong with that kid. That there's something wrong with that kid. And the boy is autistic. Mm -hmm. Like, he's always putting Zachary down. Just always putting him down. And I'm tired of that, too. Seeing my kid's face just come in just to say I love you. And his face just gets drawn. And, and put in total pain and the dirty looks he gives the kids like fuck that shit and the arguments I have with him over that shit like fine you don't like my kids you don't like me if you, you don't, don't love like my kids my you kids. don't love me mm. simple as that mm. I'm done with it right mm -hmm. sure you are Shani. sure there's better way out there than that than that and seeing the pain in my child's face I can't do it yeah how could you ever look at the man with love again knowing what he's done to your child yeah exactly yeah, exactly. How? An insane lunatic who went around the house yelling and screaming to the top of his fucking lungs. Lungs. His lungs, guys. Ugh. Like, I'm trying to sleep and he starts a fight with me. Nah, I don't buy that. I've heard him say he doesn't like living with them. I remember being in shock he said something like that. Yeah, I know. Like, at the beginning of the relationship, he was like, if only you didn't have your kids, things would be perfect. Oh, wow. And, and there's been a couple times where he tried to convince me of giving up my children. Oh. Like, what the fuck? Really? What the fuck? Fuck him. Yeah, right. Sure, Shani. <clears throat> How could you say you love your mother so much and then at the same turn convince another try to convince another mother not to keep her children? Because you need me all to your fucking self. So fucking creepy. Yeah, I agree. I can't do this anymore. You know, it. I four years. I gave him four fucking years. 
and the whole time has been disappointing and 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 just cruelty mixed with does he really love me or is he using me i don't know done with that what about does he love i'm the just kids? done with that it's always about shanny yeah Exactly. I don't want to live with that anymore. And I don't care if he goes on YouTube and and tries to fillet my character. I don't care. No, you knew he wasn't going to do that, though. You knew he wouldn't. She knew he wouldn't. Because you're, you're not the ones who have to stay up late at night. Mm -hmm. And be yelled at when you just want to sleep. And your heart beats out of your chest. No. And I know my boys are sick of being woke up early in the morning through yelling and screaming. Because he decides to have an attack because of his, his, his manic episode. Because he always blames it on that instead of thinking, hey, maybe I should have some fucking self-control over my life. Hmm. Self-control, eh? Like, I have borderline personality disorder, and I have way more control over my emotions than that man ever did. I'm gonna speed this up a little you bit. You will give your boys peace with him out of your life. Yeah, man. I want to change my phone number. I want to change my phone number. I don't want him to call me, or come near me, or have anything to do with me ever again. I want nothing to do with that man. I don't believe Yeah, I know it's affected my sons. They deserve a lot more than what they've gotten. You know? He said, he's been saying some nasty things to my kids, man. And it, it, a lot of it reminds me of the abuse I took when I was a kid, and I was like, you're gonna give my kids borderline, you son of a bitch. I want my sons happy and, and, and feel like they can be themselves without someone blaring at them or, or telling them they're worthless or some fucking bullshit. Like, you don't deserve anything, Zachary. Like, oh, God, he's so cruel. He's so fucking cruel. No. No D is worth it. Yeah, exactly, Carrie. It's time to break that cycle. It's time for me to move on with my life uh -oh. and do what's best for me. Uh -oh. And my sons, because I, I can't do it anymore. See, this was when I was in, in the picture. For the short amount of time that I was in the picture. This is the shit that she was telling me. This is the shit she was filling me with. Like, oh, she's done with Rev. Never going to take him back again. He Look at what he did to my kids. Blah, blah, blah. All meaningless. All meaningless. She had no intention of any of that. This is all just an act. Just an act. It's like... I tried. I tried. I tried. And I tried with Chris. But he, he, he is, like, the same freaking way in a lot of ways. Like, not giving a fuck if I'm hurting. Like, fuck them both, man. Did he tell me on the phone he wants to pay you to pay the phone calls. No, he keeps calling me from the jail, right? And in order to talk to him, you have to pay for the phone call. And I'm like, fuck that shit. I don't, I don't even want to talk to him. Yeah, you're right. Oh, that was so awful what he was doing to the kids during the PA ride. <laughs> it's like they have to be completely silent and, and, and just not exist in his be, presence. Like, they have it's to be so... completely silent and just not exist in his presence. Fucking gross. It's like, can I just spend some time with my kids? Someday. Someday you can. Not today, though. <laughs> Thanks. God. 
No, I'm gonna do what's best for me and my kids. Mm-hmm. I can't spend the rest of my life being miserable for a fucking man. <clears throat> Especially one who's hurt me and my son so much. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta move on. I gotta move on and do what's right for my family. Mm. Do you? Do you, Shani? I know that. I know that. Like, I really know that. And, um... Like, just hearing him just made me sad. You know? Just hearing him. It's like, is what he's saying bullshit? Is what he's saying true? Like, I I will be a perfect daddy and never do this to you. Like, I've heard that. Heard that. Been there. Done that. (laughs) I think you're making the right decision. You seem so much happier since he's been gone. We've actually heard your sons, too. And the way he talks to you isn't right either. Calling you a whore or the C word. Yeah. A zebra doesn't change. It stripes the spots. He won't change. Yeah. So many times he promised to change, and so many times he didn't. It's like, one minute he's saying he's going to change, and then like two minutes later he's doing the same thing he just said sorry for, while at the same time saying, I'm sorry, why are you being a cunt? Like, I I said sorry, like, what the fuck? (sighs) Wow. Like, learn how to fucking talk to women. Like, especially someone you claim you love. Like. And it was just a cycle. It'd just be like, two days, it would be love, 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 love. Then the third day would come along, and then I'm evil again. And then two days of love, one day of hate. Two days of love, one day of hate. And him, him thinking that saying sorry is going to fix all the freaking damage he's done. You know? What about all the damage you've done? You take him back, you will lose your boys. Yeah, I know that. Oh, did you hear that? Because that was me, I think. I said, if you take him back, you will lose your boys. And she says, yeah, I know. You know? You take him back, you will lose your boys. Yeah, I know that. And I, he's not worth it. He's not worth it. Because those boys respect me. Those boys love me. <laughs> you know, he doesn't respect me. You know, he claims he loves me, but he doesn't show me that love. Wow. Her boys respect her. Abuse I doubt and love that. bombing cycle over and over. Yeah, I can't do it anymore. I highly doubt that. The whole baby, I'm gonna change thing, I, I, fuck. It's just one too many, like, sorry's. One too many, I screwed up. One too many. And then, you know, he does this thing where he tries to make it seem like I'm the abusive one. Because I react to his abuse. Like, oh, you see what she does? You see what she does? Look at her, look what she does. Look what she does, you see? You see what she does? Like... Yeah, once. And I probably shouldn't have picked up the phone. Like, why am I the abusive one? I'm not the one going around calling people names, giving them dirty looks, and doing everything in my power to make others miserable. Fucking shitty guy. And then... Him always saying that I'm almost exactly what he wants in attractiveness. Like, fuck you, dude. Like, I'm almost fully attractive to him. Like, <laughs> oh god. What did he have to say? That he was sorry and he's gonna be better and he's changed and blah blah blah. And blah 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 blah. I sound so unforgiven and and so fucking, like, I hate this. I hate feeling this way, okay? I don't like feeling this way. Because feeling this way makes me feel really guilty. Like, you're a fucking horrible person. 
well, because I, I sound bitter. I, I, I sound very unforgiven, and I don't like that because that's not light. But it's like, I have to learn how to love myself. And if someone's treating you bad, you should avoid them and, and like, get rid of them out of your life. That's loving yourself. And I need to love myself. Yeah. Like, I can't do this anymore with him. I don't want to be miserable for the rest of my life. I don't want to be miserable for the rest of my life. You put up with a lot. Hurting you is also one thing. Hurting your boys is unforgivable. And I know you're right there, Chaos Mom. I know you are. I know you are. But, like, I always... I was abused. So, like, like I said, I normalize abuse in my head. And, like, I don't want to be like them. No, Lynn, I'm not. I don't buy the medication excuse either. He was violent before the men's. Yeah, in a lot of ways he was. Like, when he got really drunk and he used to, like, he was, like, obsessed with Negan. And he used to act Oh, oh, listen to this part, TJ. Listen to this shit, you guys. She really goes in depth right here, and it's pathetic like listen to what she tries to say about red like hair. not a ways he was like when he got really drunk and he used to like he was like obsessed with negan and he used to act like negan and he had this like really hard fucking bat and he used to just threaten to bane it in the back of my head and i was so horrified over that and um it really has messed me up. I have a lot of PTSD over that stuff. Yeah. Um, like him, him playing with weapons and stuff. Like I have a lot of PTSD over that stuff because of what he used to do when he'd get drunk and do the Negan thing. He would get drunk and do the <laughs> Negan thing. <laughs> and, and, and threaten um, to hit her with a baseball bat, right? This is how invalidating he is. Like, I tell him I'm really messed up over that stuff. And he's like, I don't remember it ever happening. So because he doesn't remember it happening, it, doesn't ha it didn't happen in his mind. And he's <laughs> devoid of taking responsibility for it. And it's like... That's why I started standing up for myself, you know, when I saw him going drunk and getting violent. That's why I did what I did in Colorado. Oh. Because I was afraid of that. That's why she did what she did in Colorado, because she was afraid of that. A.K.A. when she hit him and went to jail. Standing up for myself, you know, when I saw him going drunk and getting violent. That's why I did what I did in Colorado, because I was afraid of that. And I, sh I should really think about what I told Chantel about Nader. Oh. She went back to Nader again? Oh, Jesus. No, I don't want to do that. I don't want to be like that. I don't, like, I don't want it. I don't want it. I don't want to be hurt by him anymore. I don't want to deal with his attitude. I just, I don't, I don't want it. <laughs> I don't want to go through it again, and I certainly don't want to take the chance that I'm going to go through it again and I'm going to have to do the boys are going to have to go through it again it, it's just it's just too many times too many times and I don't know. he scares me he scares me like straightforward Do I have money support? Ugh, that's why I'm telling people to please support me on Twitch. Because you don't have to give me money. You could just watch me and, and you know, help me collect that ad revenue so I can help the boys. There's know? a reason why she's not begging for money right here and saying, oh, just support me by going to Twitch. It's because she had just gotten $1,500 from his uncle to bail him out of jail and she didn't go bail him out of jail. So she had $1,500 to blow. So she wasn't worried about money at this moment. 
that's the only reason she's not begging for it. No. But I'm glad CPS is in my life right now because they they're really doing their best to help me and wow. I can't do it. If that makes me a bad person, fine. If 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 that turns the narrative that I'm I'm letting Jason rot in jail fine, but he's hurt me. He's hurt my child children. He's really verbally and emotionally damaged me in a lot of ways. And I can't do it anymore. Mermaid princess. I can't. I Words. can't. I don't want to. <laughs> I shouldn't Mermaid have to. Princess. Words. Honestly, it doesn't matter who doesn't like you. No one deserves to be treated like crap. You have to put yourself first and your kids. Yeah, exactly. The fact Rev won't ever get a job is absolutely ridiculous, too. You get nothing from him but problems. Yeah. Yeah, and my children do have to come first. I don't think they want to be around a mom who's miserable. Mmm, really, Shani? God. What's really fucked up and abusive about all of this that she's doing right there is that those kids were listening to all this. They heard her saying all this shit. They heard her say for two weeks that she was done with him, that she wasn't taking him back, that she was putting her kids first, that he treated her and the kids horribly, blah, 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 blah. The day he gets out, all that goes out the window, she takes him right back. That's why those kids were so upset. That's why they were crying and shit. When they found out that he was coming back. Because she really did have them convinced she wasn't taking him back. She wasn't just doing that and convincing us. She was telling those boys that too. She lied to them. No, Lynn. <laughs> the only one helping me really is G-Man at the end of the day. Oh! And I thank him for helping me. Oh! You know? The only one that's helping me is G-Man at the end of the day. Mm-hmm. Nah, the only one helping me really is G-Man at the end of the day. And I thank him for helping me. You know? Yeah. I'm definitely gonna put their safety first. <laughs> All our safety. Because yeah. he can't be trusted. He can't be trusted, guys. He can't be trusted. He's done too much. And it, it... It really hurts coming to this realization because it's like... Wow, Shannon, you have like absolutely no one, but at the same time, it's like... I don't want to be hurt anymore. My parents have passed away. Hi, Sophie. So, I don't have anyone. Yeah, you don't have anyone, do you? No one. Maybe you should treat people better. <laughs> yeah, you have to be strong, sweetie. It's time he grew up. You have yourself and the kids to think of. Yeah. <sighs> yeah. I know. I want to put them first. I don't want to put him first. Zachary keeps saying how scared he is of him. Wow. Returning. Like, he doesn't want to go back to that. Wow. And I don't blame him. Wow. That's fucking sad, dude. That I felt trapped kid. in my room. The door always had to be closed, and I just had to constantly hear him ramble on over bullshit constantly and get mad at everything. Mm -hmm. Ugh, 
God. Okay, Shani. Thank you for letting me vent, guys. I really needed to vent. Like, it's just, oh. It's just so much to take in and me having to go through all these loops and hoops and and all these things for him when it's like I've gone through enough. She's gone through jump through hoops for him, y'all. Can't you tell all that she's done? Yeah, nobody should be scared where they live. That's true. No, should, nobody should be in fear of, like, constantly being yelled at, either. That's true, Lois. Like, he broke me. He broke me. Like. I have to put me and my boys first in this one, in this situation. I have to. Like, home is your safe place. I haven't felt like I was home in a long time. I haven't felt like I've been in a safe place for a long, long time. And I've gotten so depressed because of it. And the boys are depressed because of it. And it's like, he took most of his stuff and all of us had to leave a bunch of shit behind. And then he complains about the stuff he left behind. And it's like, dude, most of the stuff in the car when we came here is yours. Fucking selfish dickwad. <laughs> wow. It's fucking gross. <sighs> like, and it gets to your point, even though they're like physically attractive, you're physically attracted to them. It's like the more a man treats you like crap, the more you are like attracted to them. You know what I mean? No. The more it like sizzles out and it it's pretty much like... That attraction that I used to have for him, it's pretty much dead at this point, like. <laughs> oh my god. It just seems like some mechanical act to me now. She's, you know, not, she's not even attracted to him anymore, guys. You know, when he got out of jail and showed up at the, at the, at the house, she just, you know, went and had sex with him five seconds after him getting there because, you know, she's not attracted to him anymore. And I don't want to feel that. <sighs> Ugh. I regret this relationship in a lot of ways, I'll be honest. Because I gave up a lot for him, man. Like what? What did you give up? I gave up so much for that man. Name one thing. And he never was grateful that I was in his life. He never, he always, like, when he'd get mad at me, he always told me that he never really wanted me. He just took me in because he felt sorry for me. That really fucking hurts. And then he'd go back on that word and say he just said it just to hurt me. And it's like, why would you want to hurt me? I felt like you were attacking me. I just asked you a question. Maybe if you feel like someone's attacking you, maybe you should ask yourself if you're actually being attacked. But, like, he never took my advice. Like, all the times I told him, don't do this, you're gonna get in trouble. That's what he did, he'd get in trouble. Then the law would get involved. And then I would have to start all over again. Ugh. I, I, I hope. I am done at this point, man. I am done. And if you ladies are excited about that, and, 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 and ooh, he's single, like, I wouldn't be too excited over that. Cause oh. If he's willing to hurt me, he's gonna probably hurt you too. Wow. <laughs> and, and hurt your children.
Wow. Not if you had a baby with him and he ended up hurting your baby. Wow. Wow. He hurt dude. my baby. He hurt my baby, she says. Thank you. Thank you, Lois. Here, and just in case you guys, like, are having any kind of sympathy for Rev, let me show you this real quick. Because he deserves no, no sympathy either. He's just as bad as her. They're equally bad, in my opinion. Just listen to this. This is the Reverend with green behind him because green. And just so you know, this was right after he got out of jail, when he wasn't supposed to be at the house at all, even though he's in the car in the fucking driveway filming this. This is when he was still saying they were lying and saying they weren't going to be together and all this shit. You know. Wow, folks. Okay. And he's out of his mind crazy on drugs so... here, too. Just so you know. Rev dude here. Lunatic. This is going to be one of... It's not any teaching video. It's just answering stuff. Because I'm a, like a celebrity. Right? I said yesterday in my... In my esoteric... And I want to apologize... To people that are saying that... Jesus Jason. You're so discombobulated... That you can't even spring, you can't string like a coherent thought together. That that's not true, actually. I can, but I have a tendency to ramble sometimes because I get excited about things, you know, teenage mutant ninja turtles like that. I might be heavily ADD. Um, I personally really haven't come to a conclusion on that. I would, I, I but I am in mental health care now. And I'm going to be hooking up with people down here in the southeast uh, PA region. Uh, we have mental health partners and, and, and such. Yeah, and if you want to know, you know, we know that that Shani is a compulsive liar, right? Pathological liar. Rev lies just as much as her, though. He really does. Because all this shit that he's saying is completely bullshit. He didn't get any kind of therapy and shit. He wasn't getting help in the south part of the state. He was in the fucking driveway. So if you wonder if he can lie like she does, yes, he can and does. But I go on my YouTube again because I got that freedom that I, I can use my phone and do what I want now that I'm out of the, the clink. I, I have the opportunity to ask folks, what exactly are you thinking? Because here's the deal. I have openly admitted to you that the reason that Shani and I have broken up is due to the fact that I struck and kicked in the, the ribs Zachary. And I wasn't even aware that he had injuries. Okay? This is insane. I had no clue he had injuries. It turns out that this poor boy had injuries. He, he had bru bruised ribs. Get ready, because this shit's going to piss y'all off, okay? Because it pisses me off every time I see this. Oh, he didn't know he had in uh, injuries. No clue he had injuries. It turns out that this poor boy had injuries. He he had bru bruised ribs. Now, for me, you have to understand that I. This is good that I'm going through great pain because you're not seeing me cry about Shani off air because I don't do that. That Shani was the one to be very outspoken. And, 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 and being like, guys, you know, oh, and crying in this stuff. And, okay. And, 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 that's and, not me. You're not going to get me to do that because that's just not my character to, to mourn or openly cry about a situation. That's just not the way I roll. You're not crying because you know that you're still with her. 
Nothing's now, changing. Now, see, you guys are once again revealed to be to being uh, 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 abusive again. Because the fact of the matter is, is that Shannon is what you would call the victim in this situation. Shanny's the victim. She. Shanny, he, he beats her kid and Shanny is the victim. She is the victim. And then you come along again and abusively say, no, you're not a victim. Zachary, in, in, and in essence, you're making Zachary a liar in saying that. I was the demon. Hope you're doing good. That it did it that it didn't happen. Yeah, you're forcing him to say it didn't happen. I'm telling you that this is the most disgusting and dark shit I've ever seen. Uh, you guys have gotten really low. But now this is low, low. I am telling you that I am a horrible sack of shit. And, and, and repentance for me is, is a, an absolute must for every day now for, until the day I hit the grave. Because I put my hands on, on, on a young child. Not in a sexual way. I, want, I don't want any innuendo. It's not sexual. It's 100% it's physical harm. Like oh, Rain so Man says about Charlie Babbitt. They're they're driving in 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 Charlie Babbitt and Rain Man's father's car, going down the street. No, literally, Davis fam. She did not take her son to the hospital after that. The next day, CPS showed up at her house and made her take him to the hospital. They were like, "He's got to go. You don't have a fucking option or a choice. We're taking him to the emergency room to get checked out." She wasn't going to do it. They had to make her. And Rain Man gets a little out of hand. And Charlie Love grabs him by the neck. Demon. In the movie Rain Man, in the car. And, and then Rain Man goes, uh-oh, and he gets his backpack. And Tom Cruise is like, Charlie Babbitt. Charlie Babbitt is, is Tom Cruise in the movie. And Charlie Babbitt's going, what the hell are you doing there with your... Because it's like, you're, yeah, you're, he was recording abuse. Which is, of course, what the people at Walbrook, Next the, thing. The, the, the place where, where Rain Man was staying, was called Walbrook. Uh, Mandalorian, who took him if she can't drive? CPS took them. They made her go. They, they took both of the boys, had them both checked out, actually. But CPS came, showed up at the house, got her, got the kids, and said, we're going to the emergency room. You don't have an option. He's going to the emergency room right now. She was pissed that she had to take, that she had to go. She was literally mad that they were making her go. And of course, they would tell him now, 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 Ray, if you ever hear Ray, now, Raymond, Ray, I want you to really listen to me. OK, if any of the people on the staff or anybody that comes to see you ever, ever puts their hands on you in a bad way, that 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 is not right. And I want you to go to your notebook and I want you to record that and tell me. Okay, the headmaster of that building would definitely say that. I want you to go report that. And then someone will come back to me and the person that abused you will be reprimanded. Okay? This is the truth. This is how it would be handled in real life too. If it, that boy's autistic, he's, he's gifted in every way you could imagine. He's very smart in his own way. But, but he does have uh, 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 behavioral issues because of the autism. Now, me, as an asshole that didn't understand autism, came in as a father being, you're going to be a man and, and try, you know, because I had told Zachary 25 to 30 times, and that's not an exaggeration because I didn't want that boy being kicked out of school. And if, if they got wind of that, that, that he was on the computer all the time, he could, he could get kicked out of his virtual school. By the way. That's bullshit. What he's saying right here is a fucking lie. They don't kick kids out of school for being on the computer too much. Rev didn't want him on the computer. That's what was going on. Rev didn't want him on the computer. He wasn't going to he wasn't in danger of getting kicked out of school for anything. Like, are you fucking serious? A kid getting kicked out of school for being on the computer too much? Nobody would be in school. They all be kicked out. They all are on fucking social media and and um, computers and uh, other kind of uh, devices. Like, all the time. Constantly.
Yeah, they were being homeschooled. Yeah, they're being homeschooled. Literally, you use the computer for that. He just didn't want the kid on the computer. And he was pissed at Shanny. So he went in the kid's room, took out his anger on Shanny on the kid. Because he had probably told him earlier, oh yeah, get off the computer or whatever. So then he's mad at, at Shanny running around the house angry and sees the kid on the computer and decides, I'm going to go take my anger out on this kid. That's what fucking happened, Rev. It had nothing to do with him getting kicked out of school, you lying sack of shit. I didn't want that boy being kicked out of school. And if, if they got wind of that, that, that he was on the computer all the time, he could, he could get kicked out of his virtual school. So I was trying to be the father saying, look, son, you can't do this. And he kept, he, he just, uh, when I was in the household, he just didn't listen to me, Zachary, ever. Because he, I'm sure he sees things, oh, what's a stepdad? Oh, it's the dad that you can step on. Wow. Wow, I just realized that. The stepdad, it's the dad you step on. Wow. Dude, 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 dude. This is, this part pisses me off the most, Okay. But listen to what he just said, guys. Just listen to this shit. He was on the computer all the time. He could he could get kicked out of his virtual school. So I was trying to be the father saying, look, son, you can't do this. And he kept, he, he just, uh, when I was in the household, he just didn't listen to me, Zachary, ever. Because he, I'm sure he sees things, oh, what's a stepdad? Oh, it's the dad that you can step on. Wow, I just realized that. The stepdad. It's the dad you step on. And that was the case. But I took it that way and it was not true. Bruce, thank you so much for the super chat. You said, this would have been around the time I heard from Rev on Facebook. He thought I was on the radio still and wanted to expose CPS. Laugh out loud. That's when I went on YouTube and was shocked how messed up they are. Wow, Bruce. That sounds about right, though, timing-wise. Thank you so much for the super chat, Bruce. Because in my psychosis, like I have bouts with psychosis from time to time because of the schizoaffective. I could be pushed so far into a, oh my God, state of stress that, that I become what you would, would, would coin or call psychotic. Nope. Like, and you're, you're coming, here's the bottom line. You're coming at Shannon. Again, I have to. I, I, I'm, I'm, I'm going to protect Shani here because that's my Shani. role as, 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 as what I believe to be her husband. And, and right now it's separation. Liar. Because as far as I'm concerned, Shani has not said we're done, done because uh, we've talked on the phone a few times, and, and, and it's cool. It's like it's like we're 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 very civil, and it's it's like you just need to get your shit together, Jay, and make sure you're medicated, and we'll see what happens. Right. As you're sitting and in you're the saying fucking to her, driveway, she's the bad one for taking Zachary out of a situation that was that 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 could have led to long term abuse. Except she didn't take him out of the situation, did she? She took you right back in there and put her kid right back in the situation. See, that's why I don't have any sympathy for Rev. He is just as bad as her. He is just as big of a liar as her. They are both fucking horrible people. Horrible people. And thank God those kids are not with them anymore. Thank God. Long-term abuse. Oh, I'll get away with it. I'll get, just keep hitting the kid. That's not right. So again, you're again wrong. Because I'm the guy that you're standing up for, and I'm telling you, you're wrong for standing up for me. So who are you standing up against Shani for her abuse of her kid for taking me away? That's an abusive guy. She's protecting her son from, uh, from an abusive fucking asshole when he's not medicated. You pay, this is why nobody can take you seriously. And, and, and the Dragoons, all of you, they, they don't take you seriously because you can't be taken seriously. You just can't be taken seriously because you're willing to, for the sake of making Shanny for Christ look bad for your own weird, fucking bizarre obsession with her, 
you're going to demonize her child and make her child a, a bad guy for telling the truth about his father, which it takes bravery. He could be scared shitless, nothing's happening, and then dad is going to freak out tonight and beat me up even worse. That he uh, thought that he, noise is the windshield wipers going. Yeah, that's why you're hearing, hearing in the background. The windshield wipers keep going. I'm sure he thought that. I, 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 I gave him injuries that he got to go to an ER. And you're defending me. You are an absolute sack of shit. Do you, you're the same people that defended Johnny Depp. Guaranteed you are because this Satanist shit is, they love abusing kids, Satanists. Me, I hate it, but I felt like I was being like a tough, good dad, Christian dad. If you spare the rod, then you spoil the child. No, that's a Bible verse that's misused to abuse children physically and mentally. It means don't let your kid run amok. Right. Kid, and they get away with everything. Hold on, guys. Thing, and the, they say absolutely not. You're wrong, dude. But the way you handled it, you can't do that. You can't just say, you can't just say, my son is bold. And this was a white guy that was supporting me. This is the big secret in prisons. And this ties in with Freemasonry because Albert Pike uh, wrote about the thir three world wars. This is a big deal, okay? This ties right in my personal experience with Jesus Christ in the prison and everything vape and I got this cheap at the dollar store with some of the money and I, I don't know if it's going to fit my thing we're going to see that's that's a baby carrot look at that do 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 baby carrots now that's the size of a baby carrot <laughs> you eat it right not my penis is bigger than my penis looks like V's penis like really it does in cyberpunk the the digital model of his penis it looks like me flaccid oh my fucking god I forgot about that part are you serious, Rev? We're going to talk about penis size. See, that's that's a baby carrot. Look oh at that. Do, 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 baby carrots. Now, that's the size of a baby carrot. <laughs> you eat it, right? Not my penis is bigger than... My penis looks like V's penis. Like, really, it does. In Cyberpunk, the, the digital model of his penis, it looks like me flaccid. It looks like me flaccid. Uh, what? Vaporizer t tobacco, because the cigarettes are very rare. I get one from somebody because I'm not going to spend people's money that they give me on uh, walking down the street here with my sign in the window. You know, <laughs> uh, homeless, uh, could you spare a few? I don't work for food. Blah. It's, it's Claiming he had a sign in the window, homeless, and I'll work for food, and that's how, oh, he would never spend somebody's money that they give him on cigarettes. Get the fuck out of here. Oh my god. Aw, oh, thank you some idiot. You said, how the fuck did we go from apologizing for child abuse to making jokes about dick size? It's Rev. It's Rev. There is no thought process behind it. He just fucking vomits out of his mouth. Bullshit. Doesn't think about anything he's saying before he says it. It's just, god. This man. This boy, I should say. Thank you so much for the super chat, some idiot. Totally agree. It's I got a cardboard piece, and 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 I haven't had a job offer yet. That's crazy, right? Mm, yeah. But I'm crazy. trying to get employment at the Valero, and I think they'll pass me. Maybe I will see the background now because I have the DV. I don't know, man. The background checks, and then I got this for emergencies. It's really handy. That's going here. Okay, so. We need to talk. Esoter esoteric uh, Freemasonry. Speculative. That's another way. They call it speculative. Speculative Freemasonry. Okay? So we have to talk about this because it's a big deal. This, this all ties in with, with what I see in the prison. I'm going to tell you 100%. This is a testimony from a guy that's just been out of jail. That they are causing systematic racism... 
-hmm. in this country by way via via by way of the prison system they they're inducing they're inducing racism into the culture i am telling you that i saw fewer than 20 definitely fewer than 20 white males it's not mixed prison in lcp lackawanna county prisons not mixed thank you amanda for the super chat i really appreciate that thank you so much I don't know if any prison's mixed and crazy like that, you know, where everybody's thrown. I don't think so. Uh, uh, I, I, I'm pretty sure in Europe they have much uh, more humane system, and but they, but they commingle and they have like uh, communal, communal showers, showers with with guys and women stuff like that. That's very liberal, you know, like like uh, going back to Rome in the days of Rome, and and they got the uh, the college, uh, communal baths, you know. What? I say all that because I see in the prison Albert Pike's... Now, Albert Pike is the author of Morals and Dogma. He's an esoteric man in general uh, and, and pretty pretty gray, I believe, in his thinking. So not good, not evil, like what writing that the, the that, that narrow thing and doing shadow work that's some evil, evil stuff, some good stuff, some evil stuff. I, that, that's where I think Pike was at because he understood the value of... Uh, subversive tactics but I'm moving on that's not what this is about I just threw that in there because it all ties in with everything no okay? it doesn't tie in with the prisons shit. are 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 segregated by race and everybody's hating each other and and they're and and they 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 are definitely incarcerating in large numbers African Americans and and Hispanics and 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 everything the white man is is it's very very small numbers so like that's another reason for me to to support communism uh, the, 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 uh, the Marxian vision, which is global and, and, and no religion too. you know, we don't, we're not going to get religion mingled in with finance and government, which I agree with. I, I, I am a Christian, but I'm, I'm for the government of Jesus Christ. Everybody says they're Christian and then they're okay with their religion getting into the government, which is not. American. I have to move on because this is a very important thing. What I see is the trolls taking Shani and making her bad. And that's absolutely insane for you to take this stance. It's insane. You are enabling a, 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 an abusive father, which I was. And I want to work on myself in therapy with, with whoever I'm going to see here where I'm at. Uh, for my issues, you're I, I'm pissed at you for enabling me. Cause I see what I did was so horrible. Like I feel almost death. I like almost death because I took it too far. You can discipline your kids, but I took it too far, and I'm saying that as the 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 party at hand. Do I want to go to jail for three years or two years or one year? Because that's it goes for like one or three years for that this type of offense. Of course not. But it, there's no double jeopardy. I won't go again for this particular instance. But if it, ha if it happened again, we get back together. Me and Jannie get back together by a miracle at this point because she really don't like me. I mean, for good reason. Because now you're going to make it worse and keeping us separated. You're affecting me negatively trying to get, because I want to get back with her. You're, 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 you're impacting me negatively because it's even more in her mind that I did that. Because you're shoving it in her face that she should be supporting me. For anybody with common sense that understands what happened, and it happened... I'll say it again. I did strike him and I did. I don't remember kicking him, but I'm sure I did because his ribs were bruised and I didn't punch his ribs. How do you not remember? So what happened? It happened. I trust Zachary. Zachary didn't lie. Oh, my God. I can't with this loser. I can't. Um. All right, guys. So here's the thing. I'm going to wrap this up. Um. It has a, I have a feeling that they're going to be going live on YouTube probably shortly. And um, they'll probably be on there for a while. So um, if for some reason they don't go live again, I will um, still come back on here and we'll cover some other stuff. And we'll either watch more of um, Shani and Rev stuff 
or maybe we'll we'll go more into the um james soroka stuff there's a lot of different things but like i said i do think that they're going to be going live again so i'm going to jump off for a little while take a little bit of a break and then come back on later if that is okay with you guys um thank you for hanging out with me for a little while i promise i will be back i hate to run um but i need to get something to eat and chill out for a minute and then uh they will um I know they're going to go back on later and shit. They'll be doing their dumb, boring stream that they always do. But I will bring it to you um, no matter what. And if they don't, like I said, we'll cover some other stuff. So thank you guys for hanging out. I'm going to leave you with the song like I do. And I will see you guys in a little while. Bye, guys. Love you guys. This is just for Shani for Christ because she, she loves this song. This is my favorite song of all time. The number one. Just for my honey. Saints to my soul. Hello, I've waited here for you. Into out of her red, out of her head, she sang. Come down and waste away with me. Over my head, out of her head, she sang. And I wonder when I sing along with you, everything could ever feel this real forever. If anything could ever be this good. Thing I'll ever ask of you You gotta promise not to stop, stop when I say When she, she Breathe out So I can breathe you in Hold you And I wonder when I sing along with you if everything could ever feel this real forever. If anything could ever do this good again. The only thing I ever ask of you. You probably promise not to stop when I say you when she sang. And I wonder. Everything could ever feel this real forever If anything could ever be this good again The only thing I'll ever ask of you Is God, I promise not to stop when I say when I love you, baby I love you, baby I love you, baby I love you, baby 
Dave Grohl for life, baby. Ooh, I love you. You. Ow.